Today we're diving into the crucial role of parental influence on motor skill development and the impact it has on a child's journey in football. Have you ever considered the power of movement in a child's life? Kids are naturally drawn to physical activity, and this love for movement is the first key to unlocking their motor skill development. But here's the twist. Their learning concept is not just about imitating, it's about observing. They absorb and internalize the world around them, shaping their understanding of the beautiful game. Now let's talk about freedom. It's not just about physical expression, but also psychological psychological and verbal. Allowing children the freedom to explore and express themselves is vital in nurturing their skills. Never underestimate the power of play. It's not just a fun pastime, it's an essential tool for holistic growth. Unstructured play helps children develop creativity and problem-solving skills. It allows them to experiment, make mistakes, learn, and adapt. Furthermore, play also fosters social skills and teamwork. As children interact, negotiate, and collaborate, they learn to understand and respect others' perspectives. It's a journey that takes time, at least seven months, for a child to truly develop their knowledge and skills. But here's the kicker. It's crucial to steer clear of early specialization. Keep their minds open to creativity, knowledge, and variety. Their small bodies are like fully charged batteries ready to power them through life, but they cannot be recharged or replaced. While structured training is important, balancing it with free play is equally crucial. This balance ensures that children don't just develop their football skills, but also grow into well-rounded individuals. Remember, play is not just fun, it's the key to holistic development. So, football coaches, clubs, and academies, here's the question for you. How can we empower our young players to thrive in football by embracing their natural love for movement and providing them with the freedom to explore and express themselves? Parents and coaches, you are the unsung heroes in a child's football journey. Your influence shapes their attitude towards the game and their approach to skill development. It's vital that you encourage their efforts with positive reinforcement and constructive criticism. But it's a delicate balance. While pushing them to improve, also remember to keep the environment fun and enjoyable. After all, the goal is to foster a love for the game, not simply to hone skills on the field. Finally, let's talk about the long-term benefits of non-specialization. Hit that like button to keep this channel active. By not focusing on a single sport or activity, children can develop a wide range of skills and abilities that will serve them well in various aspects of life. They are less likely to experience burnout and overuse injuries, which are common in young athletes who specialize too early. Moreover, non-specialization fosters a lifelong love for physical activity and sport. Instead of associating sports with pressure and stress, they see it as a source of joy and fulfillment. In essence, non-specialization isn't just about the here and now, it's about setting up a lifetime of physical health and enjoyment. If a child can walk, run, jump, kick, and rotate, then they have the foundation to play football.